Um, my story is that like a lot of undergraduates, I flitted around. I always knew, I think from the time I was in high school, that I was going to be a scientist of some kind. And it didn't matter to me a lot which kind, uh, you know, physics, geology, you name it. And I went off to college and I studied first sociology and didn't really have a burning passion for sociology. And then I decided that I loved big ideas and I went into philosophy. And I decided when I was in philosophy that the big ideas I liked most were about politics. And then I thought, well, maybe I should do political philosophy instead of philosophy philosophy. And then I got into political philosophy and discovered that what I really liked about politics was the science part of it, which got me back to where I started in high school. And my, my sort of extraordinary experience is that on one occasion, someone put a box of, of what we then called punch cards in my hand and said, go ask an original question with these cards and you can figure out the answer. And that was so exciting, I've never forgotten the experience, the idea that there were questions that mattered that you could just go out and do research on them yourself and not go and read what someone said in the library, and that excitement never wore off.